Hello there! To you, Jim. Yes, I'm here with Tigers Jr., whose videos you'll have seen on... on YouTube! Yeah! And Nick, who's a... Are you one of the snowman things? Yes. And if still... you go... Sorry, what? It, it doesn't matter. I'll just shut up and eat my apples. Yeah, okay, you, you just go over there. Today we're testing the uh, Guns Plus mod by Atlan1 and the gun, uh, the gun add-on pack by the same person, which is, it just adds like more stuff in because the default game you only get like snipers and pistols. So yeah. we're going to go through all the weapons. Start with flamethrower, neopalm, neopalm, what is it called? How would you? Neopalm. Neopalm. It's usually how people say it. Yeah. So the flamethrower you can get handle, which uh, stops your recoil, but you don't really get that on a flamethrower. Or you can have just the normal one. The pump gun, which is your shotgun. You have normal one, one with the shaft, which stops your recoil a lot. Or the one with the extended magazine, which is probably the best option. Yeah, the recoil on the pump gun is massive. You will go it flying is. backwards. Hang on, wait. I'll do a... Yeah, this will have normal. Do a demonstration. Yeah, look. Can you see this? Watch, I'll yeah. shoot. You're going back about two blocks, sir. And then, normally you only go back about one if you've got a sh if one with a shaft or handle on or whatever it's called. Yeah. So all the guns I'm using, all the guns I'm using have no mods on. Oh, and we should point out, uh, you probably notice in the top left corner, there is your ammo soft supply thing, which is I think that comes in quite useful actually. And then no matter what gun, it tells you sort of what thing you've got. Uh, left click to zoom in. And then obviously left click to zoom out again. And then right click to shoot. Oh, wait, shall I pull the lever? Uh, yes. Yes, let's do that. Let's do this thing. Well, let's... Whoa, somebody blasted me. Yeah, that was me. Wasn't nice. And then the flamethrower. Okay. Okay. The range on that is terrible. Do you not think? Up. <laughs> Thank you for that. <laughs> I'm sorry. I shall give you all your stuff back. Don't worry. Thank you. What did you have? I, I don't know. You had yeah, napalm, pump shotgun, shotgun shells. Yeah, I didn't have much. I only had that. Thank you. There you go. That's all your stuff. Yeah. I'm sorry about killing you. That's good. <laughs> so yeah, there's that. Um, the should mention. The sounds of the guns and the uh, like. If you look now, when I'm zoomed in, like sometimes if you've got the guns that do it, this one. You see the uh, there's like a there's like an image that comes up in there, like a gun sort of thing in the middle, which makes it look quite good. Sometimes that doesn't load up very well, does it? No. And I mean, I'm not getting sound anymore out of this gun. Mm. Which is quite annoying, actually. Oh, I'm on fire. Wow. Oops. Did I do what? Yes, yes, you did. All right, let's. Should we? Should we move on now? Yeah. Well, <laughs> we're just on fire there. With what? This is. Hmm. I'm almost dead. Uh. Right. Ah, um. uh, I'm dying. Heal me. Heal me. Heal me, man. I'm just gonna watch you die, actually. Oh god damn it! Yeah, we, we just we just leave stuff. Yeah, yeah. So next we have heavy heavy guns and light guns. Oh, I'm gonna need all the stuff. Both come in um, with silencers and extended magazines. Oh, uh, and the light gun comes with jacket projectiles, which are just like grenades, as far as I'm aware. Um, yes, yeah, so we've got that. I'm not really gonna use that actually because you're gonna blow everything up. The shaft will just stop the recoil, which you don't get a lot of on the, these guns. Uh, the heavy gun is probably one of the best guns uh, there is. And then you've got your different ammo, obviously. Uh, these, there is a real problem. Can we delete the sign? Delete the sign <laughs> really if you will. The, the zombies are really... <laughs> right. The, uh, these are tripods. Now, they are really annoying because they don't work properly. Uh, I'm going to demonstrate it with a... I'm going to demonstrate it with another heavy gun. I'll just get it out now. Uh, just 
just get another shaft on it and then get some ammo. You shift right click to put a gun on the uh, on the map. And that doesn't always work as you can tell. See look, it's so laggy and just it's just horrible. And then Hang on, I'm just gonna go and sort this out. This is this is a definite problem with the game. Me and Nick have been messing about with these and they just don't seem to work at all. There we go, yes, it's worked. This is what happens when you shift right click. And then if you right click on it, you get the inventory. And that is pretty much just a sound you just kind of dump ammo in. And then Right. And then, basically, if you shift right click again, you can choose over to put it manual or automatic. If you go automatic, you can add targets. This is incredibly laggy. This just doesn't work at all. It's just, it is awful. Shall I bring down the cap, the targets, Captain? Um, we can do. And then you just kind of shift right click again to apply and whatever you want to yeah, it's just... And then you just destroy it like that. Oh my god, they're all gonna come out. Oh god, they're coming through! Why, sir? Why? I destroyed it! I've had a wife and kids! Yeah, but this this does have quite good power, sort of. Um, yeah, I'm just shotgunning. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> I thought that was me that killed him, then. This, this does have really good power on it. Thank you once again, Nick. You uh, seem to have a knack for killing me. Got my stuff back. Oh my god. This is... <laughs> you do get completely spam with this, though. Revenge. Oh, who's that? Revenge. Yeah, that's just a spawn bit. Yes, uh... Tripod's very laggy at the minute. We need, could do with sorting out, to be honest. Next, what do we have? We have snipers and pistols. I actually have something to say about the pistol. Yeah, what, what would that be? When you zoom in with the pistol, it seems to be a bit dodgy. The rest of them, when you zoom in, the sight seems to be very centre of the screen where the uh, aim is. But on the pistol, it seems to be a lot lower down for some reason. I don't know why. So you can't actually look through the sights on that. It doesn't look right. Why? Because I can. I didn't actually aim at you, it just hit you. Yeah. Um, all right. All your stuff is there. You can pick it up. Where is it? Where is it? Oh yeah, I'll pick it up. All right. Um. What's What's Nick going? Oh, he's dead. Right. Yes. Yeah, so pistols. Pistol ammo, obviously. Uh, sniper. Get a sniper with a silencer. A handle and just the normal one. You get pistol, just normal pistol. A silencer or an extended magazine. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill you. It wasn't me. Are you being creative? I'm not. I'm a good boy. This is what's going on. It's too late. I've already died. Oh God damn it! Right, fifth time of trying or whatever now. Let's just get hold of it. Yeah, can we not? Can we not? Can we? Can we save that for a bit later? Yeah. Can someone release this one? Right. Okay. So pistols. Right. So we're gonna we're gonna do a pistol bit now. Oh my That's God! There's a snowman. There's, there's one of them. Hmm. This bit's not. This bit's not lit up yet. We're not doing that bit. Yes, I know. So. Zooming in with the pistol. That is what Will was talking about. That is the problem right there. It doesn't... Because you aim with the little crosshair, not the actual gun. So you're going to end up dying. Sniper on your hand. That is a right beast. The only thing is that you're inverted aiming. So you press back to go forwards and opposite keys to move around.
sniper's good. Try pistol. Oh, there's a creeper there. It doesn't. The pistol doesn't do any damage. It doesn't do anything. Oh, there we go. Apparently now it's. Good. This is this annoys me. Got the lag on the gun sometimes. Yeah, I noticed that earlier. And often with, when you don't hear the sound as what well, did you it, don't. What know did I die of then? I don't know. Was it me? Yeah, what I said. Oh, okay, let's stuff. move on. Uh, we should ex say now, all these guns can be crafted. We'll put a crafting thing in the description and stuff. I'm just gonna actually know I'm gonna keep. I'm the builder for a little stock of guns. All right, let's move on. Let's flip the uh, light switch. And what do we have here? We have bazookas, yes. Come in normal, extending magazine, and handle. So yeah, you don't get as much recoil. You fire rockets at them. Oh, it's a snowman. <laughs> uh, and this is the telescope. So. Mr. Snowman, prepare to die. See what bazookas are like. The snowman is dead. Again, the cro it's out with a bit of the crosshair. Good fire and thing on the And then the telescope. Why? <laughs> How of these snowmen? What just killed me? You're not dead. I know, but what? Something hit me. That's probably me. Oh my god, creepers. Let's take them down. You gotta take them down with explosions. Teach them a lesson. I have no explosions. I have a heavy machine gun. Why is there so much snow around here? It's actually annoying. Snowman. Snowman. Oh, that's not fair, you're in creative. Mm, I'm just getting rid of a load of items that I've just randomly got. Right, there should be creepers here. Where are these creepers? There aren't any. Going ha deep into the heart of the, uh, the abyss. Oh my god, there's creepers! Ah! Alright guys, so you've seen the uh, Guns Plus mod by Atlan1, which is a very good mod. However, there are some problems with it. The first is that you don't defaultly get the flamethrower, the heavy gun, the bazooka, and the light gun. You don't. You only get a sniper and a pistol, I think, when you first download it. I think you should implement the uh, the add-on pack, which um, is in the description. Well, all links are in the description. Anything you need is in the description. Um. You should implement that into the default game. It's not hard. All you do is download it, you extract it with WinRAR, and then you just drag and drop the files into the plugin folder, and then use the gun mod folder. Uh, yeah, so it's not really that hard to do, but it would be nice if it was done for you. Because yeah, the other good, another good thing about this is you can make any gun you want and you can change these guns to have as much recoil as much range whatever you want you can change and set it to do that you can even set how you craft it so yeah can I have some water please Nick? that is that is a problem with the flame for a way they do work but I'm fine they work at quite Quite close ranges. Um, a few problems. Well, the uh, the handgun. Thank you for the water. The handgun and well, the pistols it got on the and the light gun. Both of their aiming when you aim, it's not right. If you look, the bullets go to the crosshair in the middle of the screen, and the pitch of the Handgun is obviously below that. So if I shoot in his head, 
It doesn't actually hit him. But if I shoot with the crosshair, and it's the uh, same for the light gun. And this actually come onto another problem. Sometimes the images don't load up, and neither do the sounds, because they use a they use a Dropbox. Or they use Dropbox to, uh, to get the sounds and that for it. So yeah, that is a bit of a problem. The flamethrower doesn't have the name in anything, and the bazooka has a good one. Although, oh my god. Although it does suffer from the same problem as the light gun and the thing, just not as bad. Because I feel like the crosshair is actually above where the aiming thing is. Uh, the other guns are fine though. The, this one's great. This is the heavy gun. That's fantastic. And the sniper's amazing as well. When you're zooming in, that, that's really good. Uh, all's fully adjustable. You can even adjust how far you zoom in and stuff on it. So, that's great. It's... It is a really good plugin. Um, I definitely recommend getting it for a server. If you're gonna get it, you might. I'm gonna put other plugins in the description, which you might want to uh, might want to think about getting if you're getting this one as well. It does use Spoutcraft, but that's completely it's completely fine. My Norton said it was like a loads of people use it and it's fine. But if you don't trust it, then fair enough. You do need Spout on your bucket server. Every every link you need is gonna be in the description and the form page and everything. I mean Atlant to Atlanta once well done for it. It's actually fantastic. Fantastic mod. And it's yeah, it's amazing. It's it's completely customizable. Absolutely fantastic. And the, the sounds and the images, when they work, are great as well. they absolutely great. I can't fault this at all. If I was going to rate it, I'd probably give it 4 out of 5 cookies. What would you give it, Nick? Okay. So, yeah, that's... Uh, 4 out of 5. This is not bad for a plug -in. I hope you've enjoyed the video. Um, we'll put a link, like I said, to keep saying, repeating, probably getting on your nerves. All the links you need are going to be in the description. The, uh, a video with the, a video with, uh, the gun mod and tribu, 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 yeah, which is just a zombie wave plugin, which just effectively makes your game COD. Um, which is quite cool. Oh my god, let's give him a taste of the raw medicine. Where's the bazooka? Boom. You do, you do run slow with guns, which is, that's fantastic, ow. Which is great, I hope you've enjoyed this video, I've enjoyed making it. And, comment, rate and subscribe.